Hey, this is day nine of my uh, Hindi study challenge. Um, it's been a few days since I did an update, so I thought I would do one again before I continue. And just to give you an idea of how typically um, what my schedule is. Uh, since I'm not working right now and uh, have some time, free time during the day, I try to study at least an hour uh, to an hour and a half during the day uh, when the house is quiet. And I usually plan out ahead of time uh, how much time I want to spend on each thing. So, <clears throat> uh, for example, this morning, I'm going to spend a half hour uh, finishing up the alphabet, which is the first unit in this book, which is called Beginning Hindi. Um, we're going to start Lesson 16, and I think I'll finish it in 30 minutes. Um, another thing I've been doing a lot lately is kind of concentrating on really high use uh, vocabulary and high use um, uh, phrases. So uh, on page 59 there's a lot of useful um, phrases and I made a super flashcard uh, of those terms and um, so I can just I study this every day. I don't remember what do you call X in Hindi? X ko Hindi me kya kahte hai? Uh, the second word of the sentence, that's a, I used a couple of terms to make this little set phrase just to kind of collect those words. Uh, and that is Vaki ka dusra, Vaki ka dusra shabd. Um, and again, my, my sort of test is what is useful. I think about uh, other languages that I know, in particular Spanish or Japanese, and if I can't say, if I can't use that word, if I can't say that word in, say, Japanese, then I probably don't need it in these next two months of studying Hindi. My Japanese I've been studying for years, and if I have never in that amount of time needed to say a word like, I don't know, a word like pencil sharpener, for example, then I'm not going to bother with it at this point. Uh, if I ever need a pencil sharpener, I will describe a pencil sharpener or point to a pencil sharpener. But it's not a word that I'm going to spend time memorizing at this early stage, when I still have trouble uh, with basic verbs like run and sing and drive, that kind of thing. Those are much, much more uh, useful to me at this, at this point. Uh, I've also been trying to watch Bollywood movies every day. Uh, I can never get enough Priyanka Chopra. And I'll talk more about her later on. And um, spoke with uh, my friend um, on Saturday who is uh, Indian and NRI and just he helps most with pronunciation um, so it's it's uh, today or tomorrow I'm going to try and speak with the, the, the man down the street at the, at the corner shop and ask him a couple of questions in, in Hindi and, and I'll let you know how that goes all right that's it